What's up guys, Rob here. It's a bloody red day in the crypto markets today. Everything in the top 15 is down, and not just down 1 or 2%, but we got some big losers. Monero down over 10%, Icon down over 12.5%, Bitcoin's down over 6.5%, Ripple's down almost 10%, Bitcoin Cash is down the least, down over 3.5%. So bloody red, let's dive into the Bitcoin charts and see what's going on. So I'll be using Bitcoin USD from Binance and you can see today we just took back all the gains we made yesterday. We are sitting in an interesting spot though. Hopefully we'll find some support but there's not much telling me we will. Right here at this trend line from this low to this low. That's where we're sitting pretty much right now. Now if we do break below back into this lower range here. I think we'll make another test at these lows that we saw down here just a couple days ago. But other than that, not much to glean from the one day chart. So let's dive into the four hour. And you can see here on the four hour, we hit that green nine and made the turnaround right at that green nine. Green nine signaled it with a red body. And you can see from there, we fell down, came down, dipped below this trend line from those two lows I showed on the one day chart. Dip below the next four hour bar, we got a nice pump higher, but then the next four hour bar, which we are currently in, just took that all back again. So this pattern here is looking bearish, but the last set of bearish numbers we saw, we did make it to a red three, and that's when it turned around and we started seeing the green numbers again. So we'll just have to wait and see next bar what happens to see how this shakes out. But you know, Bitcoin's just been really choppy. I haven't been doing a lot of trading on Bitcoin. It's just been a ch in a choppy no trade zone area for me. But this n green nine right here would have been the perfect area to sell since we did see that f huge fall afterwards. So let's dive in a little deeper and look at the one hour here. And that little turnaround we saw came right after we hit a red nine, but it didn't last long. And you can see here we made it up to the 20 MA on the one hour. And that's where we got pounded down again. Same thing with this green upside action right here. We made it up to the 20 and fell back from that. So this is definitely bearish. It looks like we're heading lower here on the one hour. On this one hour chart, we are going to have to break this 20 MA to start seeing another run higher. And right now it's just looking like it does not want to do that. So now going back to the one day here. From looking at the four hour and the one hour to me, it looks like it wants to go lower. Looks like bears are still in control and Bitcoin's price wants to come back here and test these lows that we saw a couple days ago. This could change if this trend line here can hold. We're going to have to wait and see what happens in this next bar on the 4 hour here for sure. Since we are at a red 3 on the 4 hour, that is the last time we turned around here. When we had red numbers, maybe bears will step back in when we, and we get a push higher. But to me, it's looking bearish. Looks like bears are still in control. But like I said, this has just been a whole no trade zone for me. Not really much I can glean from these charts. But if I had to guess, I would say that we are going to head back lower and try and test these lows again. I would love to hear what you guys think about these charts. Where do you think we're headed over the next couple days? You think we'll make another test at these lows again? Or do you think this trend line will hold up? Let me know down in the comments below. But anyways, that's going to do it for me for this one, guys. I'll see you guys in the next one. Stay living that crypto money life.